what's up guys welcome to my channel if you are new yet my name is divine i'm a musical five minominak drummer and a keyboardist i have been for many many years i started making these videos as a space for music lovers like myself to check out our favorite artists and break down some of our findings that make them so so fantastic make sure you follow us on instagram at the perseverance reaction in order to recommend the favorite singers for us to react to What's up YouTube? Hope you guys are feeling, feeling good. good. Today guys, we're back to the video guys and you're my beautiful guest. It's a makeover. Today we're going to be reacting to Rain, He, Rain. This is going to wow. be our first time checking this out. We've never seen this before. We know that we had it before. And I want to give it a try with you guys. You know how to do it? Talk less about it. Don't react more. Let's get into this video. in a wheelchair. Hi, Bren. I've been taking some time to be distant. I've been taking some time to be still. I've been taking some time to be by myself since my therapist told me I'm ill. And I've been making some progress lately. And I've learned some new coping skills. So I haven't really needed you much, man. I think we need to just step back and chill. Ren, you sound more insane than I do. You think that those doctors are really there to guide you? Been through this a million times. Your civilian mind is so perfect to always be lied to. Okay, take another pill, boy. Drown yourself in the sound of white noise. Follow this 10 step program. Rejoice, all your problems will be gone. Fucking dumb boy. Nah, mate. This time is different, man. Trust me. I feel like things might be falling in place. And my music's been kind of doing bits too. Like I actually might do something great And when I'm gone, maybe I'll be remembered For doing something special with myself That's why I don't think that we should talk, man Cause when you're with me, it never seems to help You think that you can amputate me? I am you, you are me, you are I, I am we, we are one Split in two, that makes one, so you see hey. You gotta kill you if you Damn. want to kill me I'm not left over dinner, I'm not scraps on the side Oh, your music is thriving, delusional guy Where's your top ten hit? Where's your interview with Oprah? Where are your Grammys, Ren? Nowhere. Yeah, but my music's not commercial like that. I never chase numbers, statistics, or stats. I never write hooks for the radio. They never even play me, so why would I concern myself with that? But my music is really connected, and the people who find it respect it. And for me, that's enough, because this life's been tough, so it gives me a purpose I can rest in. Man, you sound so pretentious. Ran, your music is so self-centered. No one wants to hear another song about how much you hate yourself. Trust me. You should be so lucky Having me inside you to guide you, remind you To manage expectations, provide you perspective That thing you neglected, I get it You wanna be a big deal, next Jimi Hendrix, forget it Man, it's not like that Man, it's just like that, I'm inside you, you twat No, it's not, man, you're wrong, when I write, I belong Let me break the fourth wall by acknowledging this song Ren sits down, has a stroke of genius He wants to write a song that was not done previous A battle with the subconscious, Eminem did it Played on guitar, Plan B did it Man, you're not original, you criminal, rip off artist The pinnacle of your success is stealing other people's material. Ren, mate, we've heard it all before. Oh, she sells seashells on the seashore. Fuck you. I don't need you. I don't need to hear this. Cause I'm fine by myself. I'm a genius. And I will be great. And I will make waves. And I'll shake up the whole world beneath us. That's right. Speak your truth. Your fucking god complex leaks out of you. It's refreshing to actually hear you say it instead of downplay it. 
uh, music is all about the creative process and if people can find something to relate to within that then that's just a bonus fuck you i'ma fucking kill you ren i'ma fucking kill me then let's fucking have you ren i'ma do it watch me prove it who are you to doubt my music because i call the shots i choose if you die yeah i call the shots and so i choose who survives i'll tie you up in knots when i lock you inside <sighs> news flash i was created at the dawn of creation i am temptation I am the snake in Eden. I am the reason for treason. Beheading all kings. I am sin with no rhyme or reason. Son of the morning, Lucifer, Antichrist, father of lies. Mustopheles, truth in the blender, deceitful pretender, the banished avenger, the righteous surrender. When standing in front of my solar eclipse, my name is stitched to your lips. So you see, I won't bow to the will of a mortal. Feeble and normal, you wanna kill me? I'm eternal and mortal. I live in every decision that catalyzes chaos that causes division. I live inside death, the beginning of end. I am you, you are me, I am you, friend. Hi, Ren. I've been taking some time to be this. I've been taking some time to be still. I've been taking some time to be by myself and I've spent half my life ill. But just as sure as the tide starts turning, just as sure as the night has dawn, just as sure as the rain falls soon runs dry when you stand in an eye of a storm. I was made to be tested and twisted. I was made to be broken and beat. I was made by his hand, it's all part of his plan that I stand on my own two feet. And you know me, my will is eternal. And you know me, you've met me before. Face to face with a beast, I will rise from the east and I'll settle on the ocean floor. And I go by many names also. Some people know me as hope. Some people know me as the voice that you hear when you loosen the noose on the rope. And you know how I know that I'll prosper? Cause I stand here beside you today. I have stood in the flames that cremated my brain and I didn't once flinch your shame. So cower at the man I've become when I sing from the top of my lungs. That I won't retire, I'll stand in your fire, inspire that me to be strong. And when I am gone, I will rise in the music that I left behind. Ferocious, persistent, immortal like you, we're a climate to different sides. When I was 17 years old, I shouted out into an empty room, into a blank canvas that I would defeat the forces of evil. And for the next 10 years of my life, I suffered the consequences with autoimmunity, illness, and psychosis. As I got older, I realized there were no real winners and there were no real losers in psychological warfare, but there were victims and there were students it wasn't David versus Goliath. It was a pendulum, eternally swaying from the dark to the light. And the more intensely that the light shone, the darker the shadow it cast. It was never really a battle for me to win. It was an eternal dance. And like a dance, the more rigid I became, the harder it got. The more I cursed my clumsy footsteps, the more I struggled. So I got older and I learned to relax. And I learned to soften, and that dance got easier. It is this eternal dance that separates human beings from angels, from demons, from gods. And I must not forget, we must not forget, that we are human beings.
Okay. At first, I saw him as one who's delusional. When they brought him in, I was talking to himself. And he was singing to himself about that. Mm. This guy, I tried. Then I was kind of like understanding when what he was saying. I was like, oh, this is really meaningful. Mm. And really sensible. Like when you are actually battling with your own self, your inner self. Like sometimes it happens to people. It also happened to me when you are. I try to battle and I say like you know you are right in this but you're not saying this is how it's supposed to go you get so I understand that aspect but there was a, some as points when he was acting a bit bit the, the illusion he was also saying it himself but it's it's really really nice the creativity for me was really amazing and he was talking really deep things like I don't think anyone can understand it it's something of personal experience um you can't understand it enough unless you go through what he have been through. That's the that only point you can understand it to his own kind of level. We are talking about the light, darkness, gods and human. At that moment got me kind of like confused. I feel like we need to experience what he have been yeah. through. You see when he was 17, he was thinking about the light and darkness, how it was. Then he noticed when the side where the light is being casted, the other side have to create shadows. So I don't. You can't understand it enough unless you have been through his own um, situation. But this was really entertaining. The way he sang it, the way he, um, the ending part when he's in the room, yeah, this moment is really, really nice. How his voice was going. He's really a good singer. Like he has a lovely and amazing voice, and he's really good at storytelling too. What do you think? Yeah the last one is really good at storytelling too from the beginning when he just brought it in and he started the do, 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 like i was like wow his voice was nice like the way he was humming that and like yeah. i already knew he was going to have a nice voice but i was not expecting him to rap i was expecting to just sing a cool sweet song based on the way he started at first mm-hmm. then he started this two-person conversation just him that was beautiful that is a beautiful way of telling the story and two different energy two different like two different acts like you can tell it's one person but the way the other one behaves i just feel like they have two different personalities yeah yeah so i just really love the fact that he was able to portray that he was able to not just act it out not just um sing it out he was able to act it also and that was beautiful like a lot of people go through mental crisis like a lot of people have split personalities and people tend to just bash it out thinking that um your mental health is not something that is serious but he just explained it here mental health is very very serious and we need to learn how to either seek help or not these people for having situation based on their mental health and i love the way he's saying the lyrics is very comforting it's very understandable and when he was done singing the way he explained it he talked about it that was beautiful also and the other part when he said i stand and then he stood up on the wheelchair like i love that that was beautiful and when he started singing i was talking that about cena satan and stuff like like the intensity in that point the way he was just pouring everything out like i just felt he just reached into his feelings and he was just singing based on everything he feels based on everything he understands about life and about society at large i just i want to hear more of the songs i want to see how he sings other music if this is his rhythm or this is just a part of him i just want to listen to other of his songs and understand them better because this is a wonderful song this is not about talking about love talking about women talking about um indecency this is just someone pointing at their heart their feeling what they feel and he just gave me a reminder of nf because that's how nf sing he just think about his feeling about himself about his own situation and i i feel this is not rated enough people don't tend to rate music that talk about true feelings talk about true things that are happening i just feel they need more rates they need more um acknowledgement for the things they do and the fact that they're very open about their feelings this was a beautiful song and i really did enjoy it so guys comment down below what you think about this video give us a thumbs up share this video as many as can subscribe to youtube channel you guys know how it is we'll see you guys in the next video make sure you stay I just bought a bag, like an old lady I'm back, wood smoking, I don't own papers Pass that 808, that don't, don't shake her Oh, bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater Baby mama bugging, I'm so quick to hit ignore Buku bitches in my bed, I got